Walt, thank you. Are you looking for something fun to do close to home? Well, News 12 as you covered. Today we're taking you back in time to a century old library right here in the Bronx. That's not only preserving the rich history of the borough, but also being a resource to give back to the community. News 12's Ajane Caldwell has this story. Tucked away in Westchester Square is the oldest public library in the Bronx. It opened in 1891 when this part of the Bronx was still part of Westchester County. The Huntington Free Library and Reading Room has been around since opening more than 130 years ago. And it's not your ordinary library. The space houses hundreds of artifacts from photographs to maps and newspapers. We have a board game that dates back to the 1870s. We have atlases, we have newsreels. This is not just a circulatory library. This is a rich historic resource for Bronx history. This historic landmark has been a staple in Westchester Square for more than a century and today staff have been working to keep the library alive, making it a resource for the community. We have some great events here. Uh, during COVID, we were a food pantry where we fed over 50,000 families in a span of five months. We do toy drives here. We have turkey giveaways. So this is a place where people in the community, not just Westchester Square, but anywhere in the Bronx, anywhere in the city, they could just come and enjoy the space. Visitors can stop by the library anytime, but only with a reservation. In the meantime, President Angel Hernandez is hoping to continue preserving the library's rich history and keep it going for centuries to come. In Westchester Square, Jeanne Caldwell, News 12.